box with the first ever custom I will ever have in my collection all thanks to the man BEW animations guys just check out this stop motion out there hashtag no decal club the man knows what he's doing and he's absolutely insane bro i know he's watching this thank you so much for this you the best g guys let's get started i cannot wait anymore i have been waiting almost two weeks because of ralph's figure clothing this you're like this person i hit the camera i'm sorry but guys i'm too excited right now so we're gonna open up this this is where the figure is and guys i'm very excited i hope you all guys also enjoy that intro this is gonna be it look at that all right guys first up we have the bew animations autograph i don't know i just wanted something from him because i never know if i'm gonna do something again with him and plus he's very famous so gotta get something signed by the man look at that check that out pretty darn sick i'm really happy to have that but this is what's important right here. This is the basic that he did for me. Um, so yeah, man, I just sent it to him. Oh, oh my god. Yeah, pretty cool. It's nothing much. Nothing too special, nothing too interesting. Just a little bit of a fodder that I'm gonna use, but nothing I need. So that's the Finn basic. But this, oh man, this is what's crazy. Alright, let's get this out. I have not even opened any of this. Oh snap! He gave me the rest of the Daniel Bryan. Oh my. He gave me the knee pads, the head scan, and the the boots. Or oh, these were the original Cody Rhodes boots. All right, uh, interesting. Uh, yeah, I let him keep my Elite 38 Daniel Bryan just because I didn't need it. Oh my God, guys! Holy ice cream! <laughs> 
got it. I got it. I got the little rubber band. Oh my god! Yo! Oh my god! I have the Finn, Finn, Finn Balor. Oh my god, guys! Check this out! Oh, this is insane! Alright guys, so let's get a little bit of a closer look at this. This is the Fin 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 Basic. The arms. Oh my god, look at that! He even added the freaking armband! It says worldwide with the Ballard Club logo. It's so freaking clean. Look at this. This is Elite 32. I acetone this and I did this by myself, guys. This is not paint acetone. I don't know how I did it, but it's super smooth and shiny. Right there, it says Finn, Finn, Finn. Oh my god, the knee pad, too. I, um, I just swapped that. And then the kick pads. He did it just the way I wanted. Oh my. Look at this. Check that out, the white sides. Oh my. And the black boots. This is again the Daniel Bryan and it can just move perfect. It's an accurate height as well. So check that out guys. That is awesome. That is what the main thing today I got right here. But we're not done. So he forgot to send me um the AJ Styles jacket. So this is what the AJ jacket is. So let's get move that out of the way. So this is the AJ jacket for you wondering. Oh my God, this Finn Balor is crazy. Look at that! Let me make sure there's nothing else in this just in case. Okay, nothing else. Look at this. I'm definitely putting this on my AJ right now. Look at this. The AJ Styles jacket I asked him to do for me. All those nice silver dots and that awesome designing. Again, Elite 32 Cody Rhodes, guys. Seriously, I'll get my AJ figure in a moment and put it on. But guys, just check that out. I freaking love this right now, man. Look at this. Big, big, big shout out to the man, BEW Animations, for this. Seriously, all he charged me for this, guys. Get this in mind. A freaking Tekken King pop vinyl. He did this and this and this for me. I don't even know. Oh, and the autograph. I mean, what? Wow, that's crazy. Guys, let's put this on my Elite 47 and 50 AJ right now. All right, so there's the AJ Elites. And man, these AJ Elites are absolutely awesome. Love these so much. So we're going to get started with the first ever Elite AJ. And I'm going to put this on. Look at that. The Cody Rhodes design decals have been removed. And guys, everything that BEW Animations does is all no decals. Everything is hand painted and everything. I cannot believe it. And check this. Out! Oh my god! Oh my god, bro, that's awesome! Look at that on the Elite 47 AJ, and also I'm at Elite 51, not 50. Sorry to all you people gonna spam. Oh, actually, it's Elite 51 AJ. But guys, I'm just, I'm sorry, I'm too excited right now. Oh my god, this is awesome! Yeah, this is definitely awesome. Now let's put it on the Elite 51 AJ Styles. Guys, check that out. It even matches the attire. I'm telling you, man, they needed to reuse this jacket. And just, oh my god. Again, thank you so much, BEW. This is insane. Guys, right now, we are going to open the Ralph's figure clothing, which was holding me up on this video. And let's get that open. Alright guys, the reason I wasn't even uploading a video was because first off, I have no ideas on what to upload, which I'm gonna do a lot of more uploads, guys, promise. And this stupid Ralph's figure clothing was taking 15 years to ship out. They live in the Philippines. I thought they live in China. I don't know why, but they live in the Philippines and I did not expect them to take so long to even ship out. Like, come on, man. It's just some figure clothes. And so we're gonna get this thing open right now. All right, I don't think that really worked, but we can try. They put so much tape out on this. Oh my gosh, might as well tape myself too. 
Watch, I'm gonna mess up something right now. Oh my god, there it is. Yo, let's go! <laughs> let's go! Oh my god! We have the Rouse Figure Clothing Balor Club jacket, which I specifically got for my elite right there and then we got a cm punk shirt and guys you are wondering why did you order this i have this shirt in real life which i will show you right now so since i don't have an elite yet <coughs> next week huh what? i didn't say anything. um so yeah we're gonna put these on so right now so let's uh get it open um don't know do they have anything that i can just straight up open it or do i have to i have to I have to cut it. I didn't cut it! Alright, come on. Come on, scissors. You got this. I believe in you. Okay. Good job, scissors. Alright. So now we got the CM Punk shirt that I have in real life. I was contemplating on getting the other CM Punk shirt, but sadly, I was like, nah, I don't really have it. I don't have much experience with it. But check it out. The only problem right now that I'm checking out I have with this shirt is that it doesn't have the thing on the side like my real shirt does and anything on the back. But I can't blame it because it is a freaking figure shirt. But dude, the quality on this is so good. I never ordered anything from Ralph's before. But it's super soft. And then the logo is like, it's not cheap. It really feels soft as well. Then there's the Velcro right there. Very nice. Good quality. Definitely. I highly recommend ordering from Ralph's. This is good quality. We're gonna right now put it on the my new CM Punk. Oh, wait for the next video now. Oh, what? Okay, so this is how it looks, I guess. Um, doesn't really. Is it gonna go on it or? Very cool. Wow, not bad. On this figure, doesn't look too good, and it yeah, it's pretty cool, but still freaking awesome i have this shirt in real life so really awesome to have in punk we trust right there awesome stuff very nice how they recreated that but what the main thing is guys is this balor club jacket now this is what was holding me up onto this and oh my god this was a must-have for me especially since i knew bew was helping me out with a custom which it's pretty much like 50% he did it, ma mainly him. But I did a little bit of it, but dude! Oh my god, screw you ringside collectibles. I'm saving my $34, even though this costed more. But anyways, I had all the parts uh, ready for me, so didn't even cost me anything because I had it all ready. But dude, I this is the reason why I made it, because I didn't want to spend so much money on the ringside collectibles. Plus, I wanted to have something special in my collection. Look at that Balor Club jacket. Dude, it's it's not real leather, but it looks like it. And it actually feels like kind of leather. So right here, you got some awesome stitching, which makes it kind of really look cool. It has a nice texture. The collar pops up, and you can pop it down. Then this is like that. And right here, it says Balor Club Worldwide. And exactly what BEW did right here, folks. Worldwide. That is sick. We're also going to put that on. So, let's get it ready. Oh my god! I cannot wait to see how this looks, damn it. Oh my. Already looks nice. Already looks nice. Come on. Bro. Ralph's figure clothing. Look at that. Look at that, Balor. Check that out, guys. Look at that. It looks a little too big, but it works. It works for me. Especially since, you know, it's Finn de Valor. Look at that, guys. Oh my goodness. This is amazing. This is amazing, man. Look at that. Guys, this is absolutely amazing. Seriously, wow. Thank you guys so much for watching. Huge, huge, huge shout out to BEW Animations for hooking me up with fixing this awesome Finn Balor for me and the AJ jacket. Huge thank you to Ralph's Figure Clothing to doing this, but 
It took a while, but hey, I think it was well worth it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please make sure to go subscribe to BEW Animation's YouTube channel. I'll link it down below. Please make sure to go follow on Instagram. Makes amazing customs exclusively on Instagram. You gotta go see it. Seriously, the guy's got talent, man. I've never seen talent like this before, and he has talent that I've never seen. He is amazing, man. Seriously, make sure to follow him on Instagram. And guys, while you're at it, follow me on Instagram at VenomineFigs and subscribe to join the family. We are 4,200 strong. Thank you so much. And also, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed and hit up that like button. Subscribe to join the family. And I hope to see you in the next video, guys. Peace out, guys.